What's up guys, VanamRB here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to auto farm in Southwest Florida. Now this does not use any exploits or any script injectors, script executors, none of that. This is just done from basically a macro program, and then this is also completely legal to do in this game. You will not get banned, the developers have said so, and this will also not get your Roblox account banned at all. There's no risk in getting banned from either Roblox or this game. So uh, let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, so I'm gonna show you the job you're gonna wanna auto farm, and then we'll get into what program you need to download. So you wanna go to FinTech. FinTech just is the best job for making money. As you can see, I'm in a private server. A few of my friends are auto farming it already. And see, like, he's auto farming it. You can't really tell him now. Once inside Finzek, I prefer to go to the uh, just second floor. Just because, like, that's still the first floor. Just because it's, um just gets you out of the way of stuff. I don't know. I just prefer the second floor. Does not matter at all. You just have to be inside of FinTech and you have to see this up here. So now let's go over what program you need to download. All right, so the program you're gonna to wanna to download is called Tiny Task. I have it linked in the description. As you can see, security status is clear. I've used this program. I have no viruses on my computer. Several people use this. Very, you know, easy. So you go to free download. It's completely free. You do not wanna download WinZip. You don't really need it. There's no point. So don't download that unsaid below download now hit no thanks continue to download tiny task here you takes you to download then you hit free download for pc now since i have this on my computer i'm not going to click this but this is what you'll click it's just free download for pc so downloading tiny task is really simple it's a lot of you know just it, it's just like downloading any other app and then once that's downloaded you should have something that looks like this so go ahead and open tiny task it will look like this and in here you'll see just some really simple things again this is just a macro takes two seconds to set up so what you want to do is you want to go to preferences for recording hotkey this just you know is key binds i prefer control plus shift plus alt plus r to start recording and this is just going to record your macro for what you want to insert and then playback i just have minus f8 so what you're going to want to do is hit continuous playback that ensures that it will loop so you will stay in here forever and then you're just gonna wanna record. So for me, Control, Shift, Alt, R. Then I just like to move my mouse around so I can see that it's working and jump up a few times, just so I can see that I'm going. You can just have it standing, clicking in one place. This just makes it easier to monitor that it's going. So you don't have to do that long. And then you hit Control, Shift, Alt, R again. And now it should be recorded. So again, you can hit record in here. The problem is if you do that, then you have to open it and then you'll have your thing recording every time. So you need to use a keybind. You can click play from here and that's fine. I usually just hit F8 on my keyboard because that's what I have it set as. And now my hands are 100% off my keyboard. But as you can see, it's going to keep doing this over and over again because it's essentially just recorded what I inputted into the device. So now it's just going to do this on loop and then see it stops now it'll continue on and just rewind that back and forth over and over again. And that's what makes you that's what makes the game detect that you are still active in front of your computer. Now you might be able to do this with an auto clicker and then having like a controller moving around, but this is just the easiest way for me and for I think most people because it takes you literally one second to set up. You can save them and then just open them and play them and then you're good to go. You don't have to screw around trying to get your controller going and stuff like that. So yeah, that's about it. And then once you're done auto farming, you just hit F8, it stops. And then you're good to just go ahead, close the program, and then you could go out, auto farm later on when you're ready to go auto farm again. And this makes you some pretty good money, not gonna lie. So yeah, that's how you auto farm in Southwest Florida. It's really simple. It does not take much time at all to get a fair amount of money. Again, completely inside of the Roblox Terms of Service, and it's completely allowed in this game as well. Thank you all for watching this video. Hopefully this all helped you out, and I will see you all in the next video. Without